today we're going to be replicating the look that we did for 5280's fall fashion issue. And the look is a little bit doll inspired, a little bit schoolgirl, but we're going to be bringing it down a couple notches to make it more accessible to the general public. So let's get started. The foundation for this look is a kind of dewy finish. It's really gorgeous. So now I'm going to be doing a little bit of under eye concealer. And I like to blend it straight out to the hairline. So for the lids, I'm going to put a little bit of shadow primer on there. And then I always like to run my finger over it just to pick up any of the excess. Now I'm going to be taking a little bit of kind of a shimmer powder to add even more emphasis on that healthy glow. So a big part of this look is this really beautiful blush from the makeup store called Cherry Blossom. I'm actually going to be using what is a blush color from the makeup store, but we're going to be using it on the eyes. And we're just going to be brushing it all along her crease. All right, so now we want to add a little bit of sheen to the eye. So we're going to be using a product from the makeup store again called Eye Dust. For this look, we wanted to really widen the eye to help with that sort of doll effect. So we're going to really define with black on the top. And for some people, black underneath could be a bit much. You can always go with a chocolatey brown. So you'll see I just put a really thin strip of duo along the lash line. And to give even more of that wide-eyed look, we're going to add a little bit of lighter liner inside on the waterline. So now the final cherry on top is going to be a nice red lip. So we're just going to go ahead and outline Lauren's lips. And then I'm going to take the same pencil and just lightly run it through her lip. I'm going to put a tinted gloss on top. I want it to be a little bit sheer. All right, and there you go, the finalized look from the pages of our fall fashion issue.